Milos, congratulations. Um, in some ways, you've had one of the toughest draws of anyone, Kyrgios up first, and then Vesely, who played, I think, three matches coming into the contest against you. You're still alive. You must be pleased. Yeah, I, I'm doing a lot of things well. I'm taking care of my serve. I'm efficient there. I'm coming forward. I feel like I'm controlling, dictating uh, from the baseline. And uh, the more it goes on, I'm feeling more, more, more comfortable returning as well. So things are coming together nicely, moving well. So I'm um, feeling good. And the more I play, the better I'll get. You talked a little bit before the tournament about what your team's trying to achieve in terms of bringing your game along during the grass court swing. Uh, how difficult is it implementing those elements in a match environment? Is it, is it quite tough to do that sometimes? Yeah, it, it, it is, you know, especially the first few matches till you are completely convicted and convinced that it's going to work for you. Sometimes you have to put yourself out there a bit more to sort of develop that comfort. So it's been that way. I think I came in a lot more today than I did in my first round. Also depends who you're playing against. Sometimes there's a, a more possibilities than others, but I felt like I had to put myself up there, maybe expose myself a little bit to find that solitude up uh, coming forward and on which kind of shots to come in with. A little bit about uh, John McEnroe. I guess it's a uh a different kind of feedback that you would get from when he's watching you in a practice session and then finally you get on onto a match court. I guess that's uh, that must be a positive thing having him give you feedback from ma a match scenario. Yeah, it's definitely very different and I think also it's on a practice situation it's you take the shot for what the shot is worth. Whereas in a match situation it's more on that shot, it might be the right shot maybe at a different score line, knowing how to sort of uh, evaluate and analyze those situations and then be able to manipulate it and in practice it's about what you do in a match also it's about how you can make your opponent feel and maybe you don't have to do it as well as in practice or what you're aiming for in practice but you're trying to sort of play on that sense of putting pressure on your opponent and hopefully being able to break him down and get on top of him. And just a word on what it's like having John sat courtside because I guess that's the first experience you've had this week of him yeah. watching your matches. How does that feel? Is it in intimidating in any way or just a big, a big confidence boost for you? It's, it's positive and he gives you a lot of feedback in the sense of he's, he's vocal, he's supportive, he, he, he is there, the presence is there. So it sort of brings out yourself as well in presence, making sure that you're there at that time as well and uh, he gives a lot of positive feedback which is nice. Good stuff, all the best in the quarterfinals. Thank you very much. Thank you.